Have you ever wondered if you could make your own solder paste stencils in a home workshop? Turns out you absolutely can, and I've been doing some experimentation with the Optic Laser Cutter and wanted to share some of the results. The first step is getting your files ready to cut. I use Altium, so just export a DXF of the paste layer. Then it's just a matter of trying to get out of the right material. For this demo, I'm using an index card because I found that was about the right thickness. User experience with the Optic is always a breeze. It's very intuitive and I can set it up on the desk right next to me. After that's done, just brushing it out with a toothbrush to clean off the stencil. Then it's time to grab some solder paste and try it out. Paste application is pretty straightforward, just make sure things are lined up. After applying, stencil gave pretty good definition on the print onto the circuit board. Then grabbing some components and starting to populate. I'm not fully populating the board for this demo, just a few resistors and capacitors and an IC package. Then I use a mini hot plate to reflow. I love it for jobs like this. It only needs 30 seconds or so on the hot plate. I'm just waiting for that paste to turn silver. Now taking a look at some macro shots of the results. Everything looks good. No solder bridges on that IC package and good looking solder joints all around. Let us know if you'd be interested in a longer form video about this topic, and of course, comment below what you want to see us create with the Optic next time.